What's up guys? Welcome to my mess of a kitchen. Almost as messy as my brain, which is suitable because I'm wearing my messy hair hat because my hair is also a mess today. Uh, some of you saw the short we did last week launching Lemon Light, organic electrolyte drink mix. And, you know, on one hand, there are so many electrolyte powders on the market. On the other hand, after I really looked into them, the ratios of the electrolytes, the additives and chemicals they're putting in them, I had to do it. I kind of had to do it, you know. So the ratio of sodium to potassium to magnesium to calcium in this is what naturally occurs in food. You know, you look at all the other supplements online. They're not really correct. I don't know what they're basing the electrolyte mixes off of, but you know, I mean, that's the first thing I would do. Look at how hydrated you get from eating a full meal and then match the electrolytes. It's also the most natural forms of minerals. We're using sea salt, potassium citrate, magnesium glycinate, and calcium carbonate. Some of the other mixes aren't using magnesium or they have magnesium citrate, which kind of causes digestive issues. And then they're also using like calcium lactate or forms of calcium that you don't really want. You know, carbonate is the form that naturally occurs in water. And don't get me started on the list of like chemicals and synthetic flavorings and additives. The only thing in this is organic lemon for the flavor and a tiny, tiny bit of stevia, such an insignificant amount. And the reason no one else really does this is because it's prohibitively expensive to use organic lemon as a flavoring. What's even crazier is there's no fillers. And this is something that's kind of really hard to notice. The amount of citric acid or magnesium oxide that they put in these electrolyte supplements. I don't know what percentage they're actually using, you know, whether it's 10, 20 or 30% fillers, but they're saving a lot of money. Now, I was just watching a TikTok yesterday of this guy bragging about how he was selling like a fat burner supplement that cost him, I don't know, $5 to make and he was selling it for 60 bucks, which to me is like, you're scamming people, you're scamming people. If you're charging more than a reasonable net profit margin of like 10 or 15%, then you're just ripping people off. And, and that's all of my products are using really high quality ingredients and they're also competitively priced with all the other products on the market, despite being higher quality ingredients, more natural and better products. So that's kind of why they have to shadow ban me because I put everyone else out of business. Anyway, what gets me excited guys is all the branding and stuff, you know, the creative ideas. This is kind of cute, you know, lemon light with the, the lemon as the O in, in the word lemon and then on the top. We got a little inspiration from some other brands out there, you know. I finally had to, uh, I had to fight back a little bit, you know. I'm not going to name names, but um, the branding and, and stuff wasn't 100% you know, what I was going to do, but it's definitely familiar to some people. However, what is completely original is uh, Flextros. I mean, we launched this a few years ago now, I think. Carbohydrate dextrose powder. And the reason I'm showing you guys this is because I always mix these two together. So the lemon light is really just electrolytes. You know, you got the minerals and you have a tiny amount of lemon and stevia just to kind of make it palatable and tasty. The flextrose is the pure glucose. It turns it from like an electrolyte drink to Gatorade, basically. And since it, I'm not going to go too much into the flextrose, guys, you can read more about it on the website. It's pure glucose and it's organic. The only organic high quality dextrose on the market. And that's important because all these other products are made from like corn or really low quality crappy carbohydrates and full of synthetic chemicals. So uh, we're going to combine these two today for our drink. Oh, and one very important thing I almost forgot. Uh, some of you guys did email me concerned about the amount of electrolytes. Uh, I made a mistake and I accidentally put the amount of powder instead of the elemental availability on this uh, nutrition facts label. So the correct amount is on the website and we're going to get new labels in this week uh, to make sure all of the uh, new lemon light go out with the correct label. What's inside, what's in the powder is exactly the same. I just didn't uh, do the correct. It should say either as potassium citrate or I should change it to the elemental availability, which we are doing. So like this says almost 4,000 milligrams of potassium. 
elemental availability is about 1500 milligrams so it's similar to other electrolyte powders on the market you know it's not like actually triple the amount of electrolytes so uh, just keep that in mind guys if you if you did purchase this already you can just go on the website and i'll actually put up here uh, what the elemental availability of the electrolytes is that again will be corrected with the new labels uh, coming in this week so if you guys do order this it will have the correct nutrition facts label that being said let's try some because the real reason i launched this was i was like is this going to taste good how is it going to be and after i mixed the powders together for the first time and tried it i was like okay this is really really good really delicious i have to launch this as a product the lemon light on its own is great but combined with the flextrose it's something really special so here we have a, a two cup pyrex glass because i don't think my uh, regular cup fits enough water for the the serving size so we're going to do about one and a half cups of water here so lemon light comes with a six and a half gram scoop yeah six and a half gram scoop seems like quite a bit of powder honestly and anytime you use a new supplement guys you know you don't have to use the entire recommended dose and stuff like electrolytes is really for active people you know if you're sweating all day you could do it on an empty stomach in the morning you know but a lot of people don't need this much electrolytes so then we're going to take the flextrose and do one scoop of the flextrose this is about a 30 gram scoop which is quite a bit you could honestly probably do half and half Yeah, I would say this amount is good for about two cups of water, 16 ounces. For eight ounces of water, you want to do half a scoop of each one. So we have this all mixed up. No need for a blender or anything. As I spill half of it on the floor. Fucking, I'm, I'm fucking losing it, guys. I've had enough. I've had about three dozen million dollar business ideas, but you can bet your ass I don't have a million dollars yet. Fucking bullshit. Oh my God. All right, bottoms up. Very good, very good. Does get, um, does get a little sweet. You don't have to put that much flextrose in it it's interesting because it quenches your thirst really quick you know with the high sodium potassium magnesium content your body like almost instantly says okay that's enough we're hydrated you can stop drinking yeah and you could generally go by your body you know if you go to drink this in the morning and you are like dehydrated and you're low electrolytes you're going to want to drink it just based on like your natural appetite and palate. However, if you don't really need the electrolytes, you know, you'll take a few sips of this and you'll feel quenched. You'll feel satisfied. So, you know, whenever you make anything natural, you don't have to add like synthetic flavorings or too much processed crap. It, it's pretty safe to, to go with your natural appetite and palate when you're having it. So both of these are available on organsupplements.com guys. We also have some uh, whey protein if you are interested this doesn't have carbs or sugars or anything in it. it's you know keto carnivore if you guys are still on those diets a lot of you guys bought the lemon light without the flextrose however i strongly suggest either using flextrose or honey or some other type of sweetener when you're using the electrolyte mix because chances are if you are dehydrated and you need electrolytes, you could also use some glucose. And you know, even though the amount of stevia is very small and it's mostly just natural lemon as the flavoring agent, when you're kind of tricking your body using an artificial sweetener, you do want to add some type of carbohydrate, whether it is honey or uh, I don't know, what else? That's really it. I mean, I, I would just do honey if you guys don't have the flextrose, just maybe a tablespoon or two in the lemon light when you make it. Yeah, I guess that's it, guys. Again, organsupplements.com. We got the Lemon Light new product, Flextrose, 
whey protein, a bunch of new products on the meat website, but we'll talk more about that tomorrow. As always, thank you guys so much for joining me. If you do want to support me, definitely check it out, guys, as well as my other businesses on frank-stefano.com. You can also drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below. Make sure to subscribe and check that notification bell. And doesn't matter where you guys are, we ship internationally on all the non-meat businesses. I'll see you guys soon. Thank you.